Hello and welcome back to Cubs at Home. It's great to be back. I hope you enjoyed your half-term break and are ready and excited to get stuck into Cubs at Home. So let's jump right in. Last time I showed you what you needed to do if you wanted to earn your naturalist badge. Did you enjoy the activities? It was super sunny last week so I hope you could do some of them outside. If you missed it last time, all the activities are still available online. This week I've got something really exciting to share with you. The UK Scout Movement has created a brand new badge specifically for this time in lockdown. It's called the Great Indoors Badge and it looks like this. There are nine different things you need to do if you want to earn the badge. We'll do four activities this week and the rest next week. If you don't want to earn the badge, these activities are still great to do just for fun. <music> cherry Chop is a game that's usually played using cherry stones at harvest time in France, but it's easiest just to use marbles or pebbles. Ask your family if they'd like to play with you, it's more fun with more people. Place a shallow bowl about 60 centimetres or two rulers length in front of you. Put one marble in the bowl and give each player an equal number of marbles, 5 to 10 marbles each if you can. In turn, each player must throw their marble in an attempt to knock the marble in the bowl out of the bowl. If a player misses, they must put the marble that they threw in the bowl. If anyone succeeds, they keep all the marbles that are in the bowl, leaving one behind in the bowl for the next round. It's easier than it sounds. When you've played several rounds, the winner is the one with the most marbles. Helping around the home can be really easy and can also be really fun. How about helping your brother or sister to tidy their room? Or help one of your parents to cook dinner? Or help with the washing up, the drying up, or hanging out the laundry? Maybe he'll lend a hand watering the garden, but only when it's not raining. I'm sure there are many other things that you can think of to do to help around the house. Matzo or matzos is an unleavened bread. That's bread that's made without yeast, which means it doesn't rise when cooked. It looks a bit like a cracker. Jews eat it as part of their Passover meal, which they eat once a year to help them to remember the time that their ancestors left Egypt in a hurry when God rescued them from slavery. I've uploaded instructions on how to make it onto the website. All you need is flour and water. Try it on its own, then try it with hummus, pate, or even a thin layer of chocolate spread. See what you like with it, and see what you don't. In lockdown, I found a great new sport to try. Have you heard of Zumba before? It's a bit like aerobics, but with music. To me, that just sounds like an excuse to dance. I did think at the beginning it sounded a bit weird, but I had a go and it was great fun. Why don't you have a go too, as that's what Cubs is all about, having a go at things you might not have tried before. So if you've never heard of Zumba before, or if you do some every day, jump along to the video I've shared on our website. If you enjoy it, there's loads more at the website below. Wow, you're now halfway to earning your great indoors badge. Tune in next week to find out which activities you can do to finish it off and have lots more fun. That's just about it for this week, but before I go, I want to wish Isaac a very happy birthday for this coming week. Happy birthday, Isaac. Until next week then, bye bye.